right, so hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Being Chris here, or Chris, whichever you want to call me. Uh, welcome back to the channel. If you were new here, hello, my name is uh, Being Chris, or Chris, just that again. Anyway, I'm so happy to have you all here and there is a slight difference uh, with this channel and how it's going. I do still post some Sims videos just right now. I haven't. I haven't uh, made any videos. I've been really loving the diamond painting, so um, I will post some Sims video like in the near future. But for now, I really love doing the diamond painting, and I love seeing new faces. So welcome on in, my friend. So the diamond painting we're going to be unboxing today is from one of my favorite artists, uh, Carla Gerard. And I actually uh, promised myself that I would not buy another one. But I saw this one uh, become available and I said, I want to get this so bad because I love Carla Gerard. I love the colors. I love the art. And um, it's very, uh, it's very nice. Actually, that's not even a nice word to say. Like, it's just very vibrant and I love the color. So we're going to go ahead and take a look. Now, I did mention something before that uh, sometimes we get the kits and some are new kits and some are just a regular kit without like the washi tape or the uh, mine covers. And I will have to say that uh, we got a new kit today. So let's go ahead and take a look real quick. Please do not pay any mind to my hair. It is super duper windy here today in Jersey. Like it's 54 degrees out, but it is so windy. And my hair is like all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's take a look at our new toolkit here. This is reusable and recyclable bags that they use, which I really like. I do recycle these. And we're going to do the infamous little tear right here. Tear it open. And let's see what we have. All right, so I'll let you know real quick. We're not going to get there right now. You do get a magic applicator, a comfort grip, a heart-shaped wax container, a craft tray, a tray stopper, a multi-placer, a cover minder, washi tape, which I have a collection going, my friends, zip lock baggies, which I do like, they do come in handy, and tweezers. So let's take a look. I'm going to close my eyes because I'm all excited. I'm going to put everything out on here without like ruining it. Oh, 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 did I get a new, did I get a new one? Let's see, I gotta look at my collection here. Ah, oh, okay, so we got a green one today. We got a green little mine cover right here. A little green one. I'll show you the purple one that I have. The, again, these could be like mix matched earrings. Oh, I love this. Yeah, so here we go. We have our mine cover right here. And we also have our heart shaped waxes which are very, very, very handy. And I've actually been enjoying the wax instead of the, uh, what do you call them? The uh, glue dots. The glue dots have been a, like a hit or miss for me, but I have found a solution with this, uh, with the pens, of course, and how you kind of put the wax on. So everybody has their own method, you can figure it out. So we have a uh, pen, we have our grip right here, and we also have our really cute little washi tape here. Oh, I'm loving it. And we do get our placers, which is nice. Now, I don't really use these placers. Um, I think Diamond Art Club should start a toolkit bag with just wax mine covers and washi tape and baggies and the tray. I'm sorry, I take that all back. <laughs> Just maybe not the tweezers. I mean, they're really nice tweezers though. Very nice tweezers. All right, so that's what we get in our bag here. It comes in our little toolkit bag, which I did get a new one in this one. So I just purchased one and I'm going to let you all know which one I got. And like I said, I think you all are going to enjoy it. I used my first $25 off coupon because of all the points I have with Diamond Art Club. And uh, I'm glad that I did because I really wanted this uh, painting. And I am actually going to do it 
fairly soon. So let's get rocking and rolling, my friends. Let's get rocking and rolling. I'm going to open up the canvas and see if I can show you all. All right. Okay, so this is not going to fit in my camera. I apologize, but I am going to unroll it and I'm going to tell you all off the bat. I'm so in love with this. So this is called Evening Song and it's from Carla Gerard. And look at all the beautiful houses. There's a sheep, there's birds on a wire, there's a moon or a sun. Sorry, it's not really focusing. Maybe if I put it this way front of my face there you go like that yeah that's so nice oh all right so let's take a look I might have to figure out a system here oh so this painting like I said before I'm like really having to scoot over because I have my camera overhead it is a 22 by 29 it is a uh, Carla Gerard evening song and it is square diamonds oh I love squares. Okay, I love squares. It's all to it. I love the squares. And you can see that a lot of this up here is really dark. And uh, you have your moon, which is really cool. I just, I love the folk art. I love, I just, I think it's seriously so cool. Um, let's see if I can take a look. I'm totally messing this video up like big time. So we have... So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you all as best as I can, but I do see a lot of oranges and a lot of tans and browns and stuff like that. Um, I love the sheep right here. The birds are big, so they're visible. You can see them. Um, you can see the light on the house here. Um, so I love these color houses, kind of like a primitive uh, folk art, which I really, really, really like. And over here we have more birds on a wire. We have three birdies and we have a clock right here. So sorry about my face. Um, but I, I love the purples. I love, I just love the colors so much in this. I just, I love them. I love them. So I'm going to start rolling this up so we can kind of take a look more of where we're going. Um, and then up here is where we have our moon at we have our moon um we have some trees starting up and the leaves on the trees are really pretty oh my goodness you can't see my face anyway so um i'm gonna put this painting up on the eye uh, the screen right here and then we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna take a look at the eye uh, at the colors we have because I'm excited to see how many ABs we'll get. Okay, so we have four ABs in this uh, kit. We have 47 colors. I see a lot of browns, a lot of tans, a lot of teals and blues. These colors are so colorful and they pop out. It's I really think I'm gonna have an absolute blast doing this. So let me show you the first couple colors. So we do have a 109, which is right here. And this is like a gray color. You can see this is our first AB, 109. So you got a good amount over here. And uh, we can take a look in a couple minutes about where we're gonna see these go on the canvas. Then we have a 131, which is kind of like an orangey color. Oh, I love, I love these colors. Oh, I love them so much. That's really pretty. So we have 131. And then we have a 134, which is a green. That's really pretty too. That green's really pretty. I don't know, there's something about the square ABs I really truly love. I love working <laughs> with squares. Um, I do, I do. I, I, I wanna know in the comments down below, what do you all like to work with? Do, do you prefer round or do you prefer a square? So we got a little bit of 141s, which is a white. All right, that's not bad. Yeah. And I, uh, but we also have all these, I'm gonna just show you all a few colors that I really enjoy. Um, we have these fuchsia colors, which are really pretty. 
uh, they're gorgeous. We have some really dark teal colors, like another lighter fuchsia, um, like a minty color. I have, have some tans. Uh, another looks kind of green on camera, but it's actually I don't know. Is it like a I don't know what color that is. Anyway. So we have, I love these uh, teal colors though. And let's take a look to see where these ABs will go on the uh, canvas. So I kind of knew off the bat that a lot of these uh, threes, which is the 134s, are gonna go like in the leaves right here. I see a lot of threes. So the leaves are gonna pop out with the dark uh, color in the background. Um, Let's see, we have a lot of threes, a lot of threes. Um, and the twos are gonna go around the moon over here. Um, I like that moon, or I don't know what it is. It has to be a moon, it has to be a moon. <laughs> see twos over here. Um, and also over here, you can't really see. Let me see, oh, I can't show you because my I don't have a bigger setup, which I'm going to get very soon. Yeah, I see more twos like in the windows. The windows right here. Okay, now let's look for uh, ones. So I do see some ones in the windows over here. Um, but like not a whole lot. Let me see. Three, what about the fours? We didn't see any fours yet, let's see. Fours are over here, are gonna be all the way down. So right over here, we're gonna see some fours. But yeah, I love the orange colors and how they kind of just blend in. Um, so I am so excited, I cannot wait to start on this. Um, I'm gonna put a picture back up on the screen right here so you can see it all for yourselves. And let me take a look at the description real quick so I can read it to you so you know what it is. So I'm going to pop it up on screen so you can see, because I just lost it. I was right here somewhere. Um, so this, this canvas itself has 64,532 diamonds. It is a 22 by 29 square diamonds, 43 colors plus four Aurora Borealis, uh, which are ABs, we all know that. Anyway, the description for this is, as the clock strikes eight, get ready to settle down for the night. Leaving your patch to the care of guardians on duty. Let the sky's sweet radiance set each green leaf to flickering and calm the chattering voices down to a soft patter. Oh my goodness, I tell you. Absolutely beautiful beautiful so I seriously love this so very much um I cannot wait to do this I'm actually going to start it off tonight I'm going to I uh, put everything in I'm going to leave them in bags I'm going to leave them in bags and let me show you all real quick what I have done with my previous kit I totally did not like not record that like I'm supposed to stop so for example this is for my uh proud owl one which I will also be trying to finish up soon the only downfall is is that they are um they are round diamonds and I'm just having a hard time catching on to like the feel of it like you know um but I do have it set aside but I got this these little uh this set right here from Target. I think it was like a four piece set, um, just a plain, you know, wood um, box set for like $5, I believe. And uh, so I kind of just leave them in the bags and I put the uh, little labels on and I put them in numeric order. So it's easier for me to kind of just go through them. And the good part about this is that I can bring it outside. Um, I just roll up my ca my canvas and I bring my diamonds out with me along with my wax and my tray and then I am good to go. But this is something easy if you don't want to go and buy the whole like, you know, uh, the whole like bin 
set to like store your diamonds in, this is fairly uh, easy and not expensive at all. I mean, you could find a, you know, a small box around in your house somewhere. Anyway, I think that is it for today. Uh, probably one of my last um, unboxing videos for a while, unless Carla Gerard comes out with another one, and then you know for sure I'll be back. Um, I do want to go ahead and do like a whip and chat uh, here on YouTube or on Twitch, but I just have to figure out the whole uh, camera setup because I have two cameras and um, it's just very, very hard to see the full picture. Um, so I am going to save my money up and try to get an overhead uh, webcam um, holder. I think that's what you call it. And go from there and just try to set it up since I'm usually always at my desk. Um, but yeah, so thank you all for uh, watching. Thank you all for being here. Like I said, don't mind my hair. It was a windy day here in Jersey. But I had a blast. And I really like the art. Uh, one of my favorite artists. I seriously... I'm so drawn to type of um, the type of art like this. I love folk art. I love um, the colors. I love the houses. Um, my husband's a little bit upset because he knows for a fact that I'm going to have all these hanging up in my house. So we're going to be like an AB house soon. Very soon, my friends. All right. I'm going to go. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, let me know in the comments down below who is your favorite artist. Um, from Diamond Art Club or any other uh, company you order from. And I will see you all in the next video, my friends. Have a good day. All right.